In comparison to some of its siblings, our solar system's mysterious seventh planet receives far less attention. You now have the opportunity to have a near look at Uranus, a fascinating celestial object. In comparison to its neighbor planet, Uranus is a really peculiar bird. First off, due to Uranus' highly tilted spin, the polar regions experience several bizarre seasons. At 3 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, Uranus will have passed its perigee, or closest point to Earth in its orbit. The Sun and Uranus will be at opposing locations in the sky from Earth's perspective when it reaches opposition, which will occur simultaneously. This confluence of events makes Uranus very brilliant and visible in the night sky for a prolonged length of time, essentially all night. Naturally, Uranus will still be very far from Earth at the moment of opposition, 18.69 astronomical units, or more than 1.74 billion miles. You may be able to view Uranus as a faint dot with the naked eye under very dark skies that are free of light pollution from both cities and the moon. The ideal instrument for viewing the planet, though, is a telescope, whether it be one in your garden or one at an observatory, or possibly even a pair of powerful binoculars. The blue-green color of Uranus will probably be visible through a telescope, but its 13 weak rings won't be visible because of its severe tilt. According to NASA, the planet is one of the two ice giants in our solar system, the other being Neptune, and is mostly made up of the gases water, methane, and ammonia. And, yes, diamonds do fall there, 